What is going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. So today I got up super early. I'm out here with Josh again. We're fishing in Dora Creek. It's supposed to be a really windy day today. So I'm hoping we're gonna have a bit of cover in here. Hoping to catch some good sized brim today. So all right guys, let's just get out in the water and get into it. All right, first up guys, I'm gonna be throwing some uh, surface. I've just got the MMD Splashborn tied on. Just gonna be using my Daiwa in feet with the Daiwa Certake 2500. Hoping the surface bite's gonna be firing up today. A lot of you have been messaging me on Instagram, let me know of all the brim you've been catching on the Splashborn. So I'm gonna give it a crack and see how I go this morning. There's a lot of wind this morning. Josh and I are just pretty much gonna be paddling around trying to find the spots out of the wind. I am hoping to go further up Dora Creek, I've never fished up there before. Hoping for something different, but you can't go to Dora Creek and, and not fish this part of it. So this is where Dora Creek meets Lake Macquarie. Been dead quiet for me so far. Well, if I wanted weed, I'd be doing really well today. Yep, yep, that's some weed. All right, so I've got no action on the surface. So I'm gonna try this hurricane sprat. You guys saw it in the last video. I'm hoping maybe the fish are just not keen on the surface and we'll have a bit more luck with this lure. But it's been very quiet. Josh and I are just not seeing anything on the surface. Not really getting anything. Oh, we're on guys. There we go. Oh, I pulled the hook. No. Ah, oh, that sucks. There's our first bit of action. Ah, oh, man. It must have just grabbed hold of the tail or something. Oh, well, that's promising for the hurricane sprat. Only a couple of casts in. See if he's still out there. Oh, there's a few hits again. Don't tell me it's just small brim again. Not like last week. So I really enjoyed the hurricane sprat last week, but I was only catching small brim. Thought I'd give it a second chance today and see if I can catch onto something a lot bigger. I just saw pike scatter all around where the lure is. Don't take the lure. They are smacking it though. I'm still seeing these guys smacking stuff on the surface. So I'm just going to quickly throw the, the splash prawn back out here. So I just heard something just to my right. i got to get... There we go. I was about to say I've got to get onto something soon. First cast back onto the splash prawn and I just dropped it too. Oh man. That is disappointing. Pull the hooks again. Oh man. Let's get it back in there. All right, so it's completely died off for us now. That wind is starting to pick up a little bit more. I'm gonna head back in the Dora Creek and see if the wind is any better in there. And hopefully we can get onto some fish. For the next two hours, I couldn't seem to find the fish or a spot out of the wind. I tried so many different lures with no luck. I knew the wind was supposed to change direction, so it was just a waiting game. After Josh caught his first fish of the day, we decided to head further up the river towards the bridge, where we found a good spot out of the wind and our luck started to change. There we go, that's a nice flatty, man. Cheers, man. 43 he went on the stick. Awesome work. Let him 
Okay, ready? Oh, he was ready. Off he goes. Well done, man. All right, fish, come on. Oh, that was a hit. There we go. Finally. I have no idea what it is. But it doesn't seem too big. I think it's a brim. I think. Yeah. He's not bad. Looks like he's legal size. There we go. I finally caught a fish today. There is my first legal size fish of the day, guys. Just a little brimbo on that gulp shrimp. Not too bad. I'm glad I finally got onto a fish. Come on. Yeah, you come. Pop. Looks like you're gonna get a little bit of a souvenir. You ate half the lure. Get out of here, mate. No, you don't. Nah. No. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> oh, man. Nice fish, man. Well done. Still not 40, but the race for the 40 is still on. I'm going to beat you. Beat you on this cast. Oh, yes, I think we have gone onto a patch. Tiny flatty. flatty. He is so small. <laughs> oh, I just spooked something big right in front of me. Oh man, I got hit again. Oh, I took the tail. Oh, I'm out of freaking gulps now. All right, well, let's see what this swim swim's all about then. Oh, first cast and almost got on. Got a possible wind not about to happen. Well, this ain't good. Oh. oh, that was annoying. A massive wind knot. Then when I finally untangled it, the lure got caught underneath my kayak on my drive, just to be annoying. I'm just having one of those days, I think. Oh. That could have made it better just then. Oh, that feels pretty good. I am on. It's a nice size flatty. I don't know yet. It's not a bad size flatty, guys. That's a really good size flatty. I hope I don't lose him. It's going to loosen the drag right off. Because he hasn't gone for big runs. He's just been splashing on top of the water. Gonna wait until he's happy to come to the kayak because he just keeps turning his head trying to get away from me. Just gonna wait. Come here mate. He's not a not he's not a bad size fuddy. Just gonna tighten it up a little bit. Come on. I've only got really light leader on as well, so I'm trying to take it easy. I'm not sure where I'm hooked. 
doesn't feel like a really good hook. So I'm really concerned. I really want to get this in. He's in the net. There we go. Awesome, finally. Got a good size fish today, guys. There we go, guys. That's not a bad size flatty. Sitting on about 53 centimeters. It's such a relief to finally catch a nice size flatty. It's been a long morning for me. A lot of small fish, a lot of missed hits, but it's good to get onto a good size flatty. I wish it was a bigger size brim, but I'll still take this. That was on the uh, little Z-Man Slim Swim in Bloodworm with a 1 16th jig head. I'm gonna get some photos of it and uh, throw it back in the water. Tell you what, I absolutely suck at getting hooks out of fish sometimes. There we go. Let's get it in the water. Seems pretty keen to get out of here. So you can't even see it in the water. The water is that dirty. Straight off down to the bottom. Oh yes. First cast on the on the crank. Wasn't even expecting to catch anything, so I didn't show it, show it to the camera. But we just got a nice little brim. Just as that wind starts to pick up. There we go. What's the size I need to beat for brim? 28. I don't think I have it. All right, let's see if I beat 28 centimeters. I don't think I will. Oh, I was so close to beating him. We'll even say 27 and a half. I'm pretty sure he said he got 28 and a half, but here we go. Not a bad little brim. At least I got out here and caught a legal size brim. So, get out of here, buddy.